SMV Mix. Gang, you already know, 9 to 5, we're at MV Mix. We just gonna cook up, we got some chords laid down, see what happens. We just go with the flow, see what's good. See what's good. A little old me, bro. You passing that bitch to me, bro? Damn, look at that wood. Hold on. Who rolled that Straight bitch, bro? Oh, man, behind the lens, saw that sound of this. You know what I'm saying? Following my IG and everything, cold with the camera. You know? I'm messing with my boy Nine on these beats. You already hear this shit. Nine, nah, sound like you cooking up over here, bro. What's going on? That boy none a demon. What's this you doing right now? Mixing it real quick. Taking out some blowing so it don't sound so muddy. So sound cleaner with the bass and all that. What plugin is that? This is a big fuse. How long does it normally take you to finish a beat? It seems like you're like fluent with it already. Average is like at least 30 minutes. I mean, I can what? do like quick shit, but like. <laughs> Y'all cold. You and Major be whipping that shit, boy. <laughs> Speak up, nigga. Yeah, that's great. Hey, hey, yeah. Alright. Hey. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my my god. Oh 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 my god. I said, I wanna go by 905. I said, I'm a producer, working with MV Mix, a major, and all that. I said, I'm from originally from Aurora. Dude, I said, that's how I say geese. I said, I'm originally from uh, Aurora, so I be driving down here to, um, to the studio every day. I said, um, what made you start producing? Really? What made me start producing? It was, uh, I was just on YouTube one day and I came across, um, and this was when I was like first getting into rap music too. Cause I used to, not like new, but like I used to listen to a lot of like rock and emo music or whatever. And like when I got the first, the first rap mixtape I came across was Juicy J, the rubber band business. I think I was like in seventh grade or something like that. And I saw a producer who likes Louie making beats. And I was like, damn, that's pretty cool. And then, but I've always been around music a little bit before that too. I used to play on drums a little bit. That's it. I used to do it home. I used to be on guitar center all the time, trying to shit out and all that. True. Um, yeah, it was pretty much just watching the Lex 
videos of him cooking up. And I decided to go back for losing and try out. Bet, bet. Do you have a favorite project that you did already? Like, so, if so, why? Which one is it and why? Favorite project, let's see. Merit, the first project can be mixed five. And, um, that, that came out way close for the first project that, that I dropped. Um, a lot of artists came with like the, the right energy on the beats. It matched the how. I expected it to match or whatever. Like it made me start seeing, like even there's more to to making these songs or whatever, like his songs and a lot more to it. Right, right. So when people hear it, how will people know that it's a 905 production without hearing the tag? I feel like it's gonna be because it's gonna just sound dark. That's what I get a lot. <laughs> That message just sounds too dark all the time. I feel like a lot of people are going to be able to know this song. They're, not, they're going to be able to just tell by the sounds that I probably use most of the time. Like they're really like ambient and all that. So that's probably what makes it dark. Okay. Is there an artist that you haven't worked with that you, that you are looking forward to working with in the future if you can make it happen? Honestly, uh... I got, I've been like what type of art like any artist any type of artist any music any hmm. <clears throat> so, I think my my one that's always gonna be my goal is um with that producer named Ryan Leslie he's um he used to produce a lot of different like Diddy and Cassie and all of them like um and, but I found out about him through another producer named Cartier but he's really, he'd really be more, be more overseas and all that but he'd be actually like playing each instrument on the beat and all that like he will construct it from scratch that's so, raw so like if he if he wants to add some strings and all that he'll have people come in and um play the violin um so if you want some congos he'll actually play them or whatever and then he raps too so that made me see like that that's what could produce oh, yeah. me that's decent. That's my person that I was. That's my end goal right there. It's work. So, outside of music, what do you do for fun for entertain or entertainment purposes? I really be um like going to a lot of these uh, car events with um, my cousins. Mm -hmm. Like we've been in these cars all the time. That's another thing I used to do a lot. So I do that. Um, Really, just spend time with my family sometimes, most of the time. Cause I'm always in here. So, whenever I'm out of here, it's like that time is matters with them and all that. Um, other than that, really, it's just being here. Is it right now? Other than that. Bet. <laughs>